Now coming to the various parameters of TEG and uh, Rotem. In TEG, it is a reaction time, whereas in Rotem, it is a clotting time. Kinetics time in TEG, whereas clot formation time in Rotem. And you have the alpha angle, which is same for both TEG and Rotem. And maximum amplitude in TEG, whereas maximal clot firmness in Rotem. And you have clot lysis 30 and 60 here, lysis index 30 and 60 in Rotem. What are these various indices? Let us look one by one. Now coming to the reaction time or the clotting time in the TEG and Rotem. It is nothing but the time until the initiation of fibrin formation. Here the fibrin formation can take place. And it is usually taken as a period of 2 millimeter amplitude on tracing. There will be a 2 millimeter amplitude. The amplitude will rise from 2 millimeter from the baseline. That is your reaction time or clotting time. It indicates the ability of the blood to generate thrombin and concentration of soluble clotting factor. The normal reaction time is around 4 to 8 minutes. The clotting time in rotum, in interim, I will explain what is interim and extum later. Interim, it is around 137 to 246 second. In extum, it is 40 to 74 second. And this reaction time and clotting time is prolonged when you have coagulation factor deficiency or by the use of anticoagulant. It is reduced in hypercoagulable state. Now, coming to the K time, which is nothing but kinetics time or clot formation time in rotum. This is the K time. And this is the time which is required for increasing the amplitude from 2 to 20. The amplitude which was 2 has increased to 20. It measures clot kinetics, fibrin formation and cross-linking of fibrin also. It depends upon the concentration of fibrinogen, activation of thrombin and little bit on platelet. The normal kinetics time is 1 to 4 minutes. But the clot formation time in rotum, in interim it is around 40 to 100 seconds. In next term it is 46 to 148 seconds. It is prolonged with anticoagulation, your decreased fibrinogen and decreased platelet. And it is shortened in case of increased fibrinogen level or the platelet is hyperactive. 